belief systems generally in philosophy or religion tend to orientate the young mind to a type of biological and a subconscious scripting that's very difficult to get beyond. But in the new world of discovery where everything's up for grabs, it suddenly requires us to be, as it were, universal thinkers, realizing that we must put together our own roadmap. We must overcome the tendency to separate our emotions or even both sides of our brain, the left from the right, the scientific from the spiritual, the metaphysical, the ability to work what some would call the feminist side of the human psyche. In my book called The Keys of Enoch, I orientate the readers to work with mental pictures or cosmic pictures, as well as new scientific and psychological vocabulary. So we see the synthesis at work of both sides of the brain without orienting ourselves to think in unity and oneness by using the left, the feminine, or the right, the masculine, or vice versa, we begin to overcome the difficulties and separations that will follow us to the end of our physical life. So we go beyond belief systems to being experiential human beings, beings that are in control of the life force that we live in. This requires us to seek out a balance between habitat, social relations or human relations, and ultimately cosmic relations with what I consider to be the cosmic frontier of life in the greater universe.